AppSmith Agents is the fastest way to build agentic apps with RAG and function calling and access to your internal company data. And it just got even faster. Today, we're announcing agent templates, allowing you to copy an agent that's pre-built to integrate with a specific platform like Jira, Zendesk, or Salesforce. Let's check out the Jira template. All right, so head to the Create New Menu and select AI Agent. And then you can either start from scratch or choose one of our templates. We have Salesforce, Zendesk, and Jira, and we'll be adding more soon. So today we're gonna to check out the Jira template. And it's going to ask you to connect your Jira account so you can get to the right tickets and projects. All you have to do is log in. It uses OAuth, so you don't have to create an API key. Just log in and approve it. And then select the project. So I'm going to connect to this AppSmith demo project and click finished. That'll copy the template. And now the agent is ready to use. It's going to have access to your Jira account. It can search the tickets and projects. It's able to create issues or update. And if you want, you can use it right here in AppSmith and full screen or you can embed this inside other apps. So first you'll want to deploy the agent, and then I'm going to copy from the share modal here. Click share and copy the URL. And then you'll want to install the AppSmith Agents Chrome extension. I already have it installed, so I'm going to the options here. And then just paste in the URL for your agent. And if you want, you can use the same agent in the Chrome extension on any web page, or you can set up specific mappings. So I want to use this agent on Gmail, but on the next website, like Salesforce, I might want to use a different agent. So you can deploy separate agents connected to different data sources with a different prompt and map where they connect for each website right here in the Chrome extension. So. I'm going to use this as my main one. We'll, we'll save this and then head back to Gmail. All right, I'm gonna refresh Gmail since we just enabled the extension. And then we'll open this up. You can see I have the AppSmith Agents sidebar and the specific agent that it's pulled up is the Jira one that we just deployed. So you can set this up to have a different agent in the sidebar on every website. So right now we're using the Jira one and you could also pull in data from Gmail. I'm gonna keep it simple and just copy and paste it. And then we're gonna have a separate video on the Gmail agent when that's released. So for right now, we'll just have the Jira data source. And I'm gonna ask it to create an issue for this email. Okay, it's executing the get projects query. Now I didn't tell it what project to use, so it went ahead and ran that to get a list of all the projects. And it's asking me to confirm if I wanna use this KAN for our CAN board. So I'm gonna confirm that. All right, it's extracted the data for the issue. We have a summary in the description, so it's ready for us to create. And we should get a message. There we go, successfully created the new issue. So if I come back here to Jira and refresh, oh, there it is, I didn't even have to refresh. We've got a uh, login trouble here. It's got the subject and the description. And if you wanted, it could fill out more like tags or assign a certain user just by updating the prompt and telling it how you want it to behave. So this is an easy way to deploy agents that you can use in any website Pull it up using the Chrome extension with data that's connected to your internal company tools and able to perform RAG and function calling. 